Network interconnecting devices are those devices with the help of that we use to connect the network. Very first device is the NIC. NIC is the network interface card or we say that it is the LAN card. With the help of LAN card, we can connect the computers. We have gone through the history of computer in which we have seen that earlier there was one computer and people was very happy. But they used to think that there should be something by which we used to connect the multiple computer. And let us suppose that we are having C1 as the one computer and C2 as another computer. So they thought that they should be connected with some wire and that wire was very much popular and that is the Ethernet. So Ethernet cable or the network cable or the LAN cable that was the name of that cable and we know that that particular cable is having a connector at the end and there is some kind of clip is there and this is called the RJ45 connector. Now this RJ45 connector is connected into one port. That port is very renowned where we are having two LEDs and some kind of wires are there in which that RJ45 connector is connected. This is called the LAN port or the network port. LAN port, network port, Ethernet port. So these are the name of this port. So if two computers want to connect with each other, then two Ethernet ports are required so that one wire can be connected. So one Ethernet port here, another at this place. Now we know that people are very much greedy they do not satisfy with one thing now they thought why can't we connect more computer let us suppose that this is c1 now the thought of connecting more computer c2 c3 in this manner means two ethernet cables are there and two lan ports are connected with c1 and one with c2 and another with c3 we know that the LAN port is the thing by which we get the IP address. Now if we focus on computer 1, you can see that two LAN ports are connected. That means if two LAN ports are connected, computer will be having two IP addresses. So now the question arises: is it possible that two IPs of computer can be there? Yes, it is totally possible totally possible that there can be two LAN cards inserted in a computer and there will be two IP addresses. That means we can easily say that one computer can have more than one IP addresses if there are multiple LAN cards inserted. Let us suppose that you have taken the broadband from two companies. One is from uh, Uninet or one is from CFINET. I am taking a random example. Now these two connections are coming in your computer. Now if you have selected one for the network, it will give you different IP. Then you have opted the other one after some time, it will give you different IP. So your system can have the multiple IPs also. So to connect these three computer, we need four LAN cards. Now we know that the people are still want more things. So what they thought? They thought that why not we connect more computers. Let us suppose that this is the computer number one. And now you want to connect C2, C3. C stands for the computer, C4 and many more computers. And now the option with us is connect the Ethernet cable and take out the multiple LAN cards. So one computer is having multiple LAN card in that case. Now one, two, three, four LAN cards are there. And then five, six, seven, and eight. So eight LAN cards are required and only C1 is having the 
four land cards now one more question arises that how many land cards can be inserted in one computer a system can have multiple land cards and that will depend upon the system because today we know that the usb land cards are also there so if the usb land cards are there we can connect the multiple land cards with the system so we can insert the multiple LAN cards, but the problem is there. So we are increasing the load on one system. And if the load on one system is there, one system can even crash. So that is not practically possible. So this is not the possible solution. That's why we have invented the next device, network interconnecting device, and that device is the hub.